I'm currently out here in San Antonio speaking at Kate Boylston's business plan. One attendee came up and was sharing with me that his website used to be highly ranked on first page of Google, but once the new website was launched, he couldn't find himself on first page of Google anymore. And very often is because the web development company didn't map it correctly doing 301 redirect. So I'll give you an example. Let's say that you used to be highly ranked for Las Vegas funeral home, that keyword. And there's a page within your website that used to be highly ranked for that search term. But once the new website got launched, maybe you guys didn't carry that page over because that page used to be highly ranked. Now, of course, you will not be ranked anymore. Or that content, the URL actually got changed. It used to be abc.com forward slash Las Vegas funeral home. But that page, the URL, is different on the new website. And then, of course, that URL used to be the one that got highly ranked is no longer there. It's 404, right? That's a terminology is it no longer exists. So what the web development company should have done is to do a 301 redirect and kind of think of it as a address change. You're telling Google that you're moving this page to this new URL. So just be a little careful and typically whenever you launch a new site, uh, even if you've done a lot of mapping, sometimes you'll see a little bit dip in in um, organic traffic, but it should come up steadily again. So just be a little bit careful whenever you launch a new website. Uh, we all know whenever you go with a new website, it of course should be higher conversion, looks better, more responsive, more mobile friendly. But we typically right ignore the ranking side of the new website. So just make sure that the company you're working with, the web development company, knows SEO or they're paired up with the SEO company so you do not lose much traffic.